cloud here. I'm going to change the bird sprite into the cloud sprite. Oh, not the bird, the, uh, the pig sprite. Final sprite. Maybe we'll call it uh, cloud sprite. Cloud sprite. And we'll just make it late. Oh, late. Okay. Now we should be able to change it. Oh, I'm just going to override it, I think. So if the other is the player, it's going to hit it. And I'm going to add the. So we'll start the sound that it's the, will have disappeared. I'm just going to copy. I could just copy it up here. And we'll do the cloud sprite. So I'm going to delay it a bit. I'll make it a little bit over a second, 1.1 seconds. And then we'll have a comma, and then we'll have the callback. Fat arrow shortcut, and it's the name of the move, which move from parent, which I have right there, from parent. Okay, Let's see how it goes. <laughs> Boom. So there's a little cloud puff. <laughs> Boom. It's looking pretty good. I think in the Angry Birds game. <laughs> If the pig hits anything other than the barrel, uh, it'll disappear, right? So we could theoretically change the gameplay a bit or adjust the noise. I do this from anyone watching this. Um, could maybe give it some additional density or restitution for the additional bounce, but with this. With this physics, doesn't seem like it would. Uh, yeah, unless you actually hit it like that. So we can play around with it. Uh, if someone actually builds another version of it with different physics and improved it, uh, yeah, l let me know. Just drop in um, maybe a link to the video or something. Of what you did. I guess we could make ice castles or something else. So I have my physical device now connected. I'm going to run it here. Looks pretty good. Let's pick it. <laughs> 